guys, it is Sunday, uh, September 11th, and we just went to the Egan Art Festival at the Egan Art House off of Lexington here in Egan, Minnesota. And um, I did a donation to the CSA, the Community Supported Art, and I got a box out of it. So I wanted to do an unboxing video of what was in the Egan Art um, box, I guess. So the first big thing here obviously is this huge bowl that I was very excited about. Oh, there's something like taped to the bottom. Which is has a design. There was um I believe there's 25 boxes and each one of these was different. So I really like the design on the inside of this bowl. And then they also has like a design on the outside. And then you can see the stamp in the middle. So that was really cool. Uh, so that was one of them. This was taped to the bottom of it. It said uh, Throne Fired Pottery Studio, Ned Meyer's Throne, Jerry Ned Meyer. Must be the sculptor. There's like, almost looks like a little finger. Um. Weird. Ceramic artist and pottery teacher. What? Like, is it a wine stopper? Like, I don't know. So, cool. Uh, we'll have to look more at that later. Let's put that down for now. Um, next thing, let's look at this um, thing that's kind of in front. Yeah. Certificate of Authenticity. The certifies a certificate attests that the work art described below is an authentic original work of art created by the hands of the named artist. All artwork was created exclusively for the 2016 Egan Community Art, the CSA program. So there's six different things. So let's keep going and then I'll tell you all about them. Um, there's also two little pins on top that says, I support local CSA that are cute. All right. Um, I'll do this. Maybe I'll do this one. So this one it says Tammy Filippini Photography. Evening light at Lebanon Hills Park. I shot this photo over July Fourth weekend when the days are long and the sun sets very late in Minnesota. For the CSA project, I hope to create an image that would depict some of the natural beauty that we are surrounded with in Eakin. I wanted something that will. And depths of winter remind the viewer of the warm, sunny days of summer. I hope that I accomplish that with this image. So, cool. Oh, and there's her uh, Tammy's fast frame expert picture framing. Um, kind of like business card bookmark on the back. This is really pretty. I really like that. So there's another. The second piece of artwork. Um, and then we have. Greetings to you, that says, undo the bow here, it's pretty, pretty big. and so it looks like it's just cards and envelopes, which is perfect because I always need cards uh, for birthday, birthdays, anniversaries that I send out to my family members. So that one's just like a candle. There's a card coming out of there. Mary Lee Lewis Watercolor Artist. Original hand-painted watercolor greeting cards. Available upon request. So that's really pretty. Like a flower. I feel like I'm like skipping something. Or maybe there's just two envelopes. There's just two envelopes there. Uh, he who knows nature knows peace. Oh, there we go. And then... Oh, that's really cute, too. Some butterfly and a flower. Those are really good. Agreed. So, cool. Very, very, very cool. Just back in the day. And 
we have some Stacy Mellenbrook, and they look like coasters. Streets of Egan Coasters. Wipe clean with warm soapy water. Do not submerge, not dishwasher safe. Good to know. Oh my gosh. You don't happen to have a knife on you, do you? I was in the bathroom. No. Okay. It says Stacy Melbrook Egan TSA 2016. There we go. It has it. So it looks like it's just actually like parts of maps of Egan. Yeah, here's Lone Oak Road, Silly Memorial Highway. Yankee Doodle, Pilot Knob with the Community Center. And Diffley and Lexington. So, that's kind of cool. Very different. Very interesting. Cool. Um, and then, let's see. This one, I was excited about too. So much fuzzy. Alright. Clearly this is breakable with all the packing. What is there we go. I'm fighting against painter state. Like, this is bad. All right, there we go. Okay. Ooh, and I got a green one. They had green and they had blue. Um, there's a card. TLD Creations. Whimsy but functional. Terry D. Nella, artist in Egan, Minnesota. So just like a little... That's a really cute dish. I, I The color is just absolutely beautiful. And even says CSA 2016. So, super cool. I, I, I really like that. So, nice. And, okay, that was just like more packing. I want to make sure I'm not missing anything else. And the last. Holly Tree Studios. Um, let's see what the heck. Somebody really wants to get a hold of you. It's Stan. Oh. Here's like a bunch of... Oh, this is that big thing that was also... Holy crap, Ola. Like if we needed little flakes of paper. We got it. Egan CSA 2016 sculpture. And there's like a little hole at the top so you could probably put like, you know, fake flowers or something, you know, sticking out of that. That's cool. Yeah. It looks almost like marbly. So, that is cool. I believe that's the only thing besides the sh Crazy ton of like shards of paper. <laughs> You're having more fun with that than you are with your art. <sighs> I'm making art with art. Scraps. I don't know. Uh, well, that's a really cute bag. I wanted to reuse that maybe. Okay, so. Alright, that's that. Holly Tree Studios, just about the artist, about the horsehair pottery. Because the horsehair firing process that not, does not use traditional glazes, the surface of these pieces are not fully vitrified and are therefore not food or water state. Please enjoy them for decorative pur purposes only. So, and then 2016 Jerry Nedmeyer Egan Community Supported. Oh, and that's the big bowl. Oh, she even signed it. Mm -hmm. Thanks for being part of this process. Well, thank you, Jerry. So, cool. So, uh, the six items are the Spirit Glass Platter by Terry. I'm probably totally saying this wrong. Dinella, D-I-N-E-L-L-A. 
Um, it's the medium is fused glass. Uh, the Ardea is by the Caitlin R. Dowling Stoneware Clay with Iron Oxide Terra Sigillata Application Raku Horsehair Fired is the medium. Uh, title, Original Watercolors, Greeting Cards, Artist Mary Lee Lewis, medium is the watercolor. Title, uh, Streets of Egan Coasters, Artist Stacy Mellenbrook, a medium pyrography, pyrography, wood burning on cedar. Polyurethane seal. Uh, the title is service, service, Serving Egan's Bounty. Ugh. Artist Jerry Nudmeyer, Medium Clay. And the title is uh, Evening Light at Lebanon Hills. Artist Tammy Filippini, Medium Photograph on Archival Watercolor Rag. So that's really cool. And it and it's dated today. Nice. So, um, let me, like, I really like this. Um, I really like that, you know, it was 175 bucks to support the local Egan community. And we, as our, as a family, love supporting things like the arts um, and anything we can do to, like, make Egan better. Because we love uh, where we live. So, what did you guys think of the pieces? What was your favorite piece? Um, have you gone to the Egan Art House? You know, what did you like about it? Um, let us know what you think. Uh, like and subscribe, and I will also be posting pictures on Instagram. You can look up U R A Q T I Y Q, the letters, um, and then you can also follow Cameraman L three zero H Z S um, on YouTube and Instagram. He posted some pictures of us at the Egan. What was it? Food on food four on, wheels. Yeah, food on four wheels food truck festival. Super fun. Thank you, Egan. Uh, all right, guys, let us know what you think. Have a great weekend. Thank you.